All right, Corey Sorris here for Slap News in Abu Dhabi. Power Slap number nine. Eddie, you're going up against Azael Rodriguez. A fight that we didn't know until last minute. I'm sure you knew before, but now it is on the main card as part of the live audience. How excited are you that we're all going to be able to see this fight live? I'm absolutely stoked, man. Um, it was going to be pre-recorded, and I was a little bit bummed about that because I feel like this is going to be a it's going to be an entertaining fight. And uh, yeah, I'm super stoked to be on the main card now. And I'm ready to fucking go, dude. That's it. What does it mean to you to represent, you know, season two? You know, do you kind of take pride in a camaraderie with the boys from coming from that? Or do you think, you know, we're all, we're all just part of Power Slap and it doesn't matter? No, nah, dude. Like, coming from season two, all the season two guys um, were super cool. We're super close. Mm -hmm. um, Azael was from season one. So I don't really know him too well. I met him here in uh, Abu Dhabi. Seems like a good guy. But... When it comes down to it, we do have to fight. So I'm not trying to become his friend or nothing. You know, this is uh, this is business, mm -hmm. and uh, and I'm here to handle it. I mean, talk to me about youth versus experience. Cause, I mean, it's happening here again. Um, you know, as the like you said, been around season one, has a ton of experience. Do you think uh, you know is that is that is that going to help him, or do you think that he hasn't seen somebody like you? Because even stylistically, you guys are very different. Yeah. Um. So. Looking at his past fights, even Amir, when he fought Amir, Amir rocked him pretty good, had him wobbling. I've never wobbled like that once in uh, in the three matches I've had. I knocked out Amir. When Amir hit me too, it was one of the lightest slaps that I've taken so far. And over this past year, I've been working real hard, and uh, I can't wait to show it. Awesome, man. I mean, you're a guy that brings a ton of energy up there on the stage. How do you think that's going to, you know, go up against a guy like Azael, who may not bring that same energy that Brandon did to kind of match your energy? Have you thought about that at all? Shit, man. Doesn't matter to me. <laughs> all I know is I just checked. I won the coin toss. So if he makes it out of round one, mm -hmm. kudos to him. Awesome. Besides just, you know, working in the gym, building your powers, anything else you've been doing to kind of improve here in the slap game? Have you been working on a different strike? You sticking with what you've done before? Um, anything you want to share? Yeah, no. So I have a, I have a completely different style now. Um, my strike is way different than it was. Even, um, even defending is a lot different than it was. I've went over a couple, like I've went over everything with, um, with some of my coaches and I've been training Muay Thai for the last year as well. I've been doing, uh, well, jujitsu, but I've always done jujitsu, um, wrestling as well. And, uh, I think, uh, I think putting it all together, mm -hmm. it's really gonna, it's really gonna show this Thursday and yeah, I'm ready to shock the world because, uh, there's a bit of a ranking difference, uh, between me and Azael, but I'm ready to jump the ranks and, uh, yeah, I'm coming for that belt, man. I'm ready for a title shot soon. Awesome, man. What do you think your keys to victory are in this one? Shit, man, my keys to victory. I think it's the same for everyone and you want to finish it as quick as possible. So if I can go in there. I can knock him out round one, then uh, that's obviously the goal. I'm going to go home, still looking good, feeling good. Mm -hmm. And, you know, that's, uh, that's what I came here to do. And that's what I think I'm going to do. So I'm not really too worried right now. Awesome, man. There's the middleweight belt on the line. We've got Isaiah Kionas going up against John Davis in this one. Who do you think is going to win that match? It's hard to say, to be honest. Um, John's got John's got good defense, really good defense, and um, I've seen Isaiah as well take some take some hard hits and still come out of it. So it's gonna be a tough one. I feel like that one's gonna probably go the five. We'll see. Um, I do see Isaiah winning, but um, but it's a tough call, man. They're both tough dudes. Awesome, my man. If uh, Isaiah is watching this interview, what do you want to say to him leading into the match? Uh, I don't know. I just met you, man. You seem like a good guy. But uh, it's all going to change when we step up on stage. And uh, big respects to you. I wish you the best. But uh, this is business. And uh, like I said, I'm here to handle it. Awesome, man. Appreciate you joining me. Representing Canada loud and proud here in Abu Dhabi. All the very best, my man. Fuck yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you.